Okay, so I've been wanting to show off a little bit about Affinity Publisher for a while now in a video, and I just haven't found something really that's you know, distinctive enough that people haven't covered elsewhere for me to do. However, this week I came across a really cool feature when I was uh, working through a, an insert I had to do for a, a project. A lot of times we're trying to take one letter sheet and putting two copies of the same item on a single sheet cutting it in half and then we have two saves paper, saves ink, saves time. Uh, my aversion to dead tree data transmission format aside, uh, there is a cool thing that allows Affinity Publisher to really do a, a, a neat way of handling this. If you're using a typical desktop publishing app, you're going to have to put, create two separate copies of the same item on two different pages and then print it out and you can get it to, you know, to face. I used to, I have an imposition software called Cheap Imposter that I used to do that with uh, just in pages to do something really simple and quick. However, I never really had something that, that could print spreads directly. And I have that here in Affinity Publisher, which is really cool. So you see I have up here a, a sheet. It is designed as a half letter sheet. So, you know, the great logical American measurement of 5.5 .5 inches by 8.5 inches. And I have a quarter inch border all around since I don't have any printers that can print to the to the edge. And you see I just have a nice little end up cool feature demo. So I want to have two of these on one single sheet of eight and a half by 11 paper, US letter. So I'm gonna hit Command P and here we are. So here I am with my single copy. It's on US letter and you see it's just centered on the page and it's got a huge border around it. This is not what I want to do. So what I'm going to do is up here in range and scale, I'm going to go to document layout and where it has single, you can see all these different ways that I can set some something up and I'm going to set up N up and I'm going to say I want two on a sheet and watch what happens. So now it has that on the bottom here and this other bit is blank. I don't have that second copy there. Well, this little checkbox here, fill last page, if you click that, the magic happens. And now I have my layup of two of the same uh, document uh, on the same sheet of paper, ready to be print, ready to cut in half, ready to hand out to people who will probably never look at it and throw it away. This is really a cool thing.